was imminently trying right. to trade for Jalen, like right. it's on the front burner. Right. Like we're ready to go here if we can go. And we and you see the teams that are interested, obviously yeah. Kansas City, the Eagles, the Raiders, I guess, are interested. But you know what, Skip? This mm. is the kind of deal. You guess who will get, guess who will get Jalen Ramsey? The Patriots. No. Mm. And then I'm watching. I ain't watching TV. I'm not watching exactly. TV anymore. I, I told you what I thought of him. I still say he has become more trouble than he's worth. Obviously talented, but I'm not buying. So if you want your Chiefs to have him, your homeboy, good luck. I want him. Good luck. I want him. Yeah, because you guaranteed a couple days ago on this show they would become prohibitive yep. favorites to win it yep. all with Jalen Ramsey. Ah. Uh, Cause this is I'll what take we, that. This is what we do. So you see, see, everybody thinks that we're going to put him on A.B. That's not yeah. what we'll do. Okay. We'll put him on Josh Gordon. Oh, and then we'll roll yeah. coverage to A.B. And we'll let Honey Badger do what he does, mm. him and Edelman. Y'all fight it out. Okay. Well, at the rate uh, A.B. is going, they'll he'll be on Josh Gordon because there'll be no A.B. <laughs> <laughs> no. At least going to take care of that one for you. We'll see where Jalen ends up. But uh, Minshew, the mustache, and the Jags now have a long week to rest and prepare to travel to Denver to take on. Ooh, Shannon's uh, Broncos up next. All right, it is time now to dive into Super 6 NFL Sunday. It is the new free-to-play game where you can win up to $250,000 of Terry Bradshaw's money. That sounds good, huh? Yep. One of the Super 6 matchups this week, which we'll get into right now, Tom Brady and the Patriots hosting uh, the winless Jets. Mm. The Patriots are a whopping 22-point favorite at home against the Jets this weekend. That's according to Fox Bet. Patriots have outscored opponents 76 to 3 through just two games this season. And that's not the only huge spread. Hmm, the Cowboys also 22 and a half point favorites against the Dolphins this Sunday. Shannon, big spreads. Who covers and by how much? They're both. Easily. Easily. Both of them covering. Shannon Sharp says easily. Easily. I got the Patriots covering 52 to 3. 52 to 3? 52 to 3. I got to write that one 49? down. 49? Yes. Skip. Yikes. Skip. They're playing a third string quarterback <laughs> with a terrible mm. offensive line, mm. which means. By the way, that third stringer was the predecessor at Washington oh, State no, to Gardner Minshew. Yes, Go ahead. he was. Yep. Yeah, it, look, it is not like the Jets are not trying. Yep. They're trying. They just don't have a whole lot to try with. Mm. Now, Greg Williams, you know, look, Greg Williams is, is, is a great defensive coordinator. I love his style. Now, he's going to get you. Now, he'll, he'll, he'll bring a blitz that you haven't seen before, and he'll get Tom Brady. He'll probably get him on the ground once or twice, Skip. But those cracks that he leaves... That's a guy that'll exploit those. Yep. And mm -hmm. he that that's not, you know, that's not Baker Mayfield. He and that's not Josh Allen. This guy, the, the guy that you're going to play in his building, mm -hmm. they'll light you up. And Coach Belichick doesn't call the dogs off. Coach Belichick coaches his team. Yep. His job is not to keep the score down for your team. Yep. That's your job. Yep. Coach Belichick says, Mr. Crowd pays me to coach my team. Mm -hmm. I'm not trying to coach yours or trying to help you. Yep. So you keep the score down. Okay. 52 to 3. And I got the Cowboys also covering easily. Easily? Be because guess what? The Dolphins just switched to another quarterback, not like he's any better than the one they switched out. But look, you know what? <clears throat> you at least need to see what you have moving forward. You might need to be in the business for a quarterback. I guess I saw the signs tank for Tua. Yeah. <laughs> or maybe they wait another year and try to get Trevor Lawrence. Who knows? Maybe. But I got the Cowboys, Skip. They covering easy, too. Really? 45-6. 45-6? 45-6. Shannon's feeling generous That's today. That's 39 points? Yep. So you have Patriots by 49 yep. and Cowboys by 39 yep. points? Yep. Yep. Because you know why, Skip? Look, Skip. If you're at home and you give up 59 points, to Lamar Jackson, mm -hmm. you at home, you give up 43 to the Patriots, you're going to go on the road, and you're starting an another quarterback. Mm -hmm. Skip, they're not very good. Skip, mm -hmm. here's the thing. There's a difference between being not good and trying mm -hmm. and being not good and not trying. Okay. The Dolphins are not even trying. Mm -hmm. They've traded away anybody. If you thought they might be attempting to play good and play hard, they traded anybody that could possibly help them. You get rid of Minka Fitzpatrick. You trade uh, Steels. You trade uh, uh, Larry Tunsil. Uh, what's uh, forget what's left? Who's left? Mm. Forty-five six. Mm. So you know what? It just dawned on me. My Super Bowl pick was Cowboys versus Patriots. 
So even though I love my Cowboys, and I'm not a huge Patriot fan, but I do love my Tom Brady. You do? Just for one Sunday, I wouldn't mind betting against those two teams and that quarterback. You're going to lose, Skip. Give me... Give me 38 in Dallas, and nope. I'll, I'll take the Dolphins. Mm -mm. 38. Nope. You just nope. said they're going to win by 39. Nope, nope. nope. 38. Nope. I'll do it right nope. now. No. 38. No. Okay. Give me 48 in the Jets. No. 48. No. Well, you just said easily. Easily. Cover it easily. Well, put your do where your mouth is. But skip. Put here's... your do where your mouth is. I take that. Skip. Yeah. Skip. Come on. Skip. That's my line. Vegas only gave him 22 and 22 and a half. Okay. But the mere fact, three, t skip. You ain't never seen three, t three t like you said. It was the strike season, and when the strike season 1987. happened, but, the, it but was San because the Joe stars Montana. had walked the picket line right. uh, to to play against what they called scabs. I right. hate that term, but that's you know. But yeah. but San Francisco yeah. had Joe Montana and Jerry Rice, and the yeah. team they were playing against did not had replacement players. <laughs> exactly. Yes. So that's why, and uh, the Cowboys, mm -hmm. those guys had come back, Randy. I ain't gonna say no name, but you know who they were. You, a the big, parade, the big, yes, our parade. Yes. yes, walk the picket line. Yes, they absolutely. Yep. And I also sat there in the press box at Old Texas Stadium and watched Joe Gibbs with pure replacement players beat the Cowboys on Monday Night Football with their stars back. Mm -hmm. You believe in that? <laughs> okay. So this is the flip side of that. This, this is you're saying easily. And that's actually what's called Washington won the Super Bowl that year. They did once they got their their players mm -hmm. back. Theisman, Riggins. Yep. Okay. Or no, that was earlier. That was the earlier one. Yeah, that was 80. Yeah. That was, yeah. 82. 82. Yeah. Okay. So back to this. I'm going to start with my Dallas Cowboys. Timmy Smith was running back yeah, then. Yeah, he was. He was. The Broncos. Yep. Okay. I do not believe my Cowboys will cover 22 and a half points. Right. That's historic. Mm -hmm. That's outrageously wrong in the National Football League. And I hear what you just said. But about you said they're historically their good. With Who? Dak and Amari. Historically good. I just said they're going to win the NFC. Does that mean they're historically good? Well, if they're going to win the yeah. NFC, and that's one of the worst teams in the, in the AFC. Okay. Too many injuries. Too much of a letdown after two big wins over two division rivals. Whether you think so or not, in that locker room, they don't like the Giants, and they really don't like the Redskins. So it's going to be a little bit of a letdown after those two games. And they will be looking ahead on Sunday to the next Sunday when the season, quote, unquote, starts at New Orleans. And I don't care whether it's Teddy Bridgewater or Taysom Hill. And we're going to talk about this in just a few minutes. Yep. It, it's the, the Saints are still a loaded, very good football team. They have a good defense. And as Jen well knows, because she's there often and she lives in New Orleans, it's a hard place to win a football game Absolutely. in that Superdome. So, again, they might be looking ahead to at New Orleans, and then the following Sunday, Aaron Rodgers visits Jerry World. Yeah, so, it's a hard place to uh, uh, win a game when Drew Brees playing. Okay. But well, they we'll got see. beat last year. When Remember Teddy, Teddy Bridgewater started the last yeah. game? Yeah. They caught the L. Okay. And did that matter? No. no but that, matter. that's my point, though. It's the tough place when Drew's under center. Okay. So, we know about the injuries. There's no Michael Gallup. There's no Tavon Austin, probably. He's still in concussion protocol. So you're down two receivers, and you're down two woods on defense. You're not out of the woods Well, Miami's defense. down 46 players. Wait, well, wait a second. You don't have Antoine Woods, who's the anchor of their defensive line, and you don't have Xavier Woods, who's the best of the two safeties on the backside of the defense. And there's no Tyron, uh, Tyron Crawford in the defensive line. He had a sack last week. So how do you get up for this game? Easy. I don't know. So I'm going to call it 34 to 14 because okay. I, I keep telling you, my defense keeps scaring me. I haven't seen it come together and gel and click. Skip, they haven't seen it skip, yet. Skip, they've only scored seven points. How are they going to get 14? I, Josh Rose, I don't know. There'll be a garbage touchdown. You know, this is, you, you talk about backdoor covers. <laughs> if they score 14, and my defense is highly capable of giving up 14 points, they got Devontae Parker. He's pretty good. Well, they, well, okay. they, well, they, well, they okay. get back 14, okay, so what? 40 to 14. 34 to 14. Mm -mm. They I get got more the, than that. Uh, now, the Skip, Patriots, they scored 31 against okay. Washington. Okay, but the, here's the flip. I, you, they're not going to be ready for this. They don't hate Miami. They have no history with Miami except what they gave Miami. Do you remember that Thanksgiving Day game when Leon Lett Leon gave them football, the yeah. football game on the block <laughs> kick? Do you remember this? In I the do. snow? Yep. It actually snowed in Dallas, Texas on Thanksgiving, Thanksgiving. which yep. was impossible. Mm -hmm. And Leon Light gave them, he, he, he literally just sort of handed them the football game, right? <laughs> yep. Okay. So that's the only history with Miami and the kids in this locker room have no idea about that because there's no animosity. There's no rivalry. Mm -hmm. 
the Patriots hate the Dolphins because Tom Brady was 7 and 10 going to Miami. That was his record in Miami. Right. And they got victimized by the Miami miracle just a year ago. Right. So you don't think they go down there to say, let's rub it in? Tom Brady played late into that game, late in the fourth into the fourth quarter. And okay? he gonna and, play even later and, into and, this game. By the way, I will also remind you that game was only 13 to nothing midway third quarter. Mm -hmm. 13 to nothing right. and two pick sixes happened. Yep. So you you got a big break there if you if you gave the points. Mm -hmm. Because it's it's hard to get that many if they score any, but but again, Miami. Didn't score in right. right? Yeah. So if they're gonna be challenged to okay, score against I, your team. I, I'm gonna say that the Jets find some garbage touchdown way to score seven. <laughs> but I also think Tom Brady will hang 40 on the Jets because they hate the Jets. Yes. It's another division rival. Yes. And they will take every opportunity to, so to speak, step on their neck. Yes. You know, like rub it in, rub their noses in mm -hmm. it. They don't like Greg Williams. They don't like, you know, they're they're going to try to exact their it's pound the of flesh. Because a lot, Jets. a lot of how we perceive yeah. New England, right, is because of what transpired with the Jets turning state seven against them. Okay, they were up there like six go. nine. They were like Takashi six nine right. up there giving right. a interview. Okay, testimony. Okay, so how are the Cowboys going to get up? They're going to go on the field and look at the Dolphins and uniforms. Like we don't even know who these guys are. They know. Okay, yeah. no, they don't. Oh, you gonna see Skip? Yeah. Well, you must really believe in my offense. If you... Forty-five. Whoo! Wow. Really. Okay, well, give me 38 and 48, and I'll take them. Mm -mm. Nope. Nope. Why not? I'm that? not betting against myself. <laughs> huh? I want to be this. I'm, I'm going to get this one right, and then I'm going to be able to come out here Monday and say, I told you so, Skip. Really? Yeah. Well, put your do on it. Mm -mm. You, you, I don't want to just, like you tell you, me, I don't want to jinx it. You have no courage of your I got conviction. plenty of courage. Skip, I got courage. I just told you what the score's going to be. Uh -huh. Okay, well, then back it up. I'll back it up. I'll take those points. I mean, 33. You, you're you're outrageously too high. But think about it, Skip. I should have went 53 because you see they went 33, Ooh. 43, and they're going up by 10, increments of 10. Okay. They're what going did up, you go to? What I, go, it, I went 49. 52 to 3. 52 to 3? Yeah. 49 and 39. Okay. Just give me 40. I'll take 47. Nope. Okay. 47 points. Nope. nope. That's a pretty easy cover, nope. right? I would nope. take that. Nope. nope. Okay. Mm -mm. All okay. Right, so so you have no courage of conviction. No. Next question. <laughs> no, Shannon's no. expanding the margins. Yeah. Skip the strength. There's them. a real chance the Dolphins go zero. Mm. Zero. For, uh, I think my defense hasn't arrived yet. It might somewhere along the line. Well, not yet. If, if, uh, uh, if D Law don't get a couple of sacks this game, Skip, I don't know. Well, he came up all zeros against the Redskins. Nothing, 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 nothing. Well, no tackles, no pressures, no nothing. Okay. You'll be right this week. Okay. Josh Rosen That'll getting be. the start for the Dolphins over Fitzmagic. We'll see if that makes any difference. All right, so we have Skip and Shannon's picks in. We will see what happens this weekend. Don't forget, before the NFL games kick off on Sunday, download the Fox Sports Super 6 app, play Super 6 NFL Sunday for free, and you get a chance to win $250,000 of